Hi, I'm Paul Moody of EasternDiamondbacks.com. We're here today to talk about one of our natural resources, the Eastern Diamondback Rattlesnake. This snake is indigenous to the Sandhill region that we're in right now in the Ocala National Forest. This snake is the largest rattlesnake in the world. It obtains a record length recorded at 96 inches. This animal in particular is roughly estimated at about five feet in length. As you can see, this is actually a docile species which only resorts to further action when molested or bothered in its natural habitat. This animal in particular, as you can see, is quite girthy in length feeding basically upon rabbits, squirrels, and ground nesting birds in this region, the Eastern Diamondback signifies a healthy ecology in this woodland. If you're ever in this woodland and encounter this species, I would suggest strongly to avoid it. This snake, as you see, is actually very docile unless molested. As a professional snake handler, I do not advise interaction similar to this with a wild, venomous reptile. Only professional handlers should be in close contact with these type of reptiles. For safety issues, I would definitely recommend avoiding them when come in contact in the wild and give a wide girth. Upon leaving a good girth, the snake will be very calm and relaxed and will not engage in any sort of action with a human being. If you'd like to learn more about the Eastern Diamondback Rattlesnake, you please visit my website, easterndiamondbacks.com. For more information, photographs of these magnificent snakes in the wild, genetic research, captive propagation, and specimens that are available for qualified individuals. I have been working with the Eastern Diamondback Rattlesnake for over 10 years in captivity. This species is on a serious decline and I feel that the captive propagation of this animal is going to ensure its existence in our future and for our children. I'm just gonna hold them up there so you can see a little bit more of this snake. Coloration, as you can see, is very cryptic in a natural habitat. The different various shades of browns and tans allow this serpent to go unnoticed in ambush of prey. It also enables this snake to avoid disturbance from potential predators by laying motionless in a cryptic pattern and avoiding detection. The rattlesnake has evolved over the years a warning system for hooved mammals, particularly grazing species that once inhabited Florida, such as bison, white-tailed deer, and trespass livestock known as cattle. The rattle was formed to allow the livestock detection of the snake to allow it to keep from being stepped on and trod as the snake lay in a pasture. Over the years, rattlesnakes that inhabit islands where livestock are not present have lost the use of the rattle and have thus evolved rattle less.